for me, I went from wanting to be in pastoral ministry for over a decade and then uh, serving in, in the church to uh, going back to software. And it was really daunting, but um, being in this class and then being with others that were in the same position, it, it was, uh, it made it so much easier. Okay, my name is uh, Trent Cooper and I am a software engineer. I currently work with SRP Software. Um, I also worked in software from uh, the early or late 1990s until about 2008. I uh, worked with several um, large companies, including uh, Motorola and uh, IBM. Um, being in software for you know over 15 years, I uh, decided to um, follow a path of going into the ministry. And so worked in several churches and uh, served in um, different capacities, you know, including some technology, but, you know, mainly, mainly serving um, congregations and serving the people. Um, and I, you know, did that from 2011 until I wanted to get back into uh, doing software development and have been doing that now for about um, six months. So. The motivation I had to uh, get back into software and take this course uh, was I knew that much has changed in the landscape of software development since I last, you know, worked in a full-time position, uh, and I just wanted to get ramped up. And I, you know, I, I've kind of done that on my own before, but it's different than having a class with a course that's laid out and structure, and then also working with others. So. Um, after go I went to the University of Texas um, and graduated in 1998. And so when I decided to look for um, an opportunity to get back in to software, I went to their website to see if they had anything that would help people kind of retool for a new career. And that's how I found uh, the program. Oh, it was really good. Um, it, was, it was great because they had a, a path for people that had done some development, so it was nice to hit the ground running. And I found the, the course material to be um, kind, of at, kind of at a good level as far as um, a starting point and then ramping up and then the homework being both challenging at the same time and having good examples of, um, you know, existing code to kind of guide you on the way. And it was good. I think um, with all the different topics that you cover in full stack development, uh, I really like the order in which it was done and the amount of time that was spent spent in each and then kind of having a, a project that we worked on that tied things together as we went. I uh, was fortunate enough to meet someone in orientation that uh, lives in the area. And so every single week that we you know did class together, we were, we were kind of encouraging one another and, and uh, keeping up with one another. And so I think being part of a group doing the class and seeing the same names every week um, was was probably one of the best parts. So I think the the number one thing that I you know took away from the program is just once again reiterating, but with more detail, um, I, there were skills that I learned when we when we learned uh, CSS and uh, HTML and React. I ended up getting a job in Angular, but there's enough similarities that I was able to apply that and it helped me hit the ground running. Um, but more recently in the last month and a half, uh, the CTO of our company has asked me to work on a research project uh, with MongoDB. And so um, it was, the timing was perfect. I, we went through our Mongo unit and in the last month I've been working on a project in MongoDB that is basically a bridge between an older technology and Mongo. and. Uh, the company, you know, at least the, the leadership is really excited about um, moving forward with that. And so uh, once again, very thankful for that. And that's, that's a, a detailed assignment that I got that uh, um, was really, really helpful in helping me to feel comfortable that I could actually take on that assignment at work. If you're considering switching, you know, like for me, I went from, you know, being in, um, wanting to be in pastoral ministry for over a decade and then uh, serving in, in a church to uh, going back to software. And it was really daunting, but um, being in this class and then being with others that were in the same position, it it was, uh, it made it so much easier. And it's, it's 
just been something I, I, I couldn't even anticipate where I am today. So I'm thankful.